Hey folks, any cubic cobra go? Based upon some other YouTube videos that I've made, someone has asked if I would create a video how to calibrate the extruder and how to calibrate the stepper motors for the XYZ axes. I have done that to this printer and I did it based upon Daniel Crosslink's YouTube channel. He has one video for uh, calibrating the extruder and another one for being able to calibrate the XYZ axes. If I felt that I had some value to add to it, I would create those videos myself, but I did learn from him and I do feel like he deserves the credit for that. I've made a few discoveries of my own that I did not find on the internet and that's part of the reason why I started creating uh, videos. I know a lot of people were struggling with this printer uh, in various forums, Facebook, etc. And I just felt that I could help by creating some videos from what I know and what I have learned. Of course, my digging into this thing, I have learned an incredible amount since I first started with it. Unfortunately, not my first 3D printer, so I had experience with a printer that was out of the box that, that worked right away this one did not but it is capable of incredible prints and it is repeatable but you're gonna have to tame the beast and so that's my goal was to try to help others so that they won't give up and that they will continue because this has honestly been a fantastic pastime for me I've designed some incredible parts and I've repaired all kinds of odd things of course nothing that would um, risk anyone's safety but you know salvaging things that would be could be thrown away anyways that's a whole other story I mean I have I have other videos for that but the value that I'm trying to add here is that I am going to list this YouTube video under the any cubic Cobra go calibration steps and link to Daniel's YouTube channel because his is generic and so when I did the searching, I had to go through a few videos until I found somebody that did a good job explaining and that had some credibility. So I wanted to uh, keep my word because I said I would and thank you for making the request. I appreciate it. I will share more discovery that I've got ready to go. I just have to create the content. So that being said, you will need just a prelude you will need a computer you don't need a super powerful computer because uh Prondra face is a free download it is not a heavy program so i have an old i5 sitting on the side and uh, Prondra face is loaded up over there you'll need a usb to type c cable to be able to connect to the printer and you will need a caliper for when it comes time to be calibrating the stepper motors. The caliper will be very handy for calibrating the extruder as well, but it's not critical. You could use a measuring tape for that and it'll be close enough. But for the stepper motors, you're going to need to print a calibration cube and you're going to need to measure it fairly accurately to be able to apply what Daniel is uh, teaching and sharing. Anyways, thanks so much for watching and uh, keep your eyes posted because there will be more material that I will be creating specifically geared towards this printer and to try to help people who took advantage of the great price but the fact that it's not really an out-of-the-box printer. You need to have a certain amount of skill and uh, a certain amount of assistance and videos I find is a great way to be able to do show and tell uh, a lot easier than trying to write paragraphs and have somebody read and understand whatever it is that you write. Anyways, happy printing. Thank you for watching and uh, see you soon.